We're here in the Wamba studio with Eddie Maroon, the co-founder of Anrami, a web and mobile music streaming platform. Eddie, how are you? Hi, I'm fine. How are you? Are you enjoying Arabnet? Yes. A great show, great opportunity to meet great people. Excellent. And uh, mabruk on the investment that thank MEVP you. just announced. Thank you. Thank you. Um, so can you describe the platform to me? It's like a Spotify for the region? Describe well, uh, Anrami is an unlimited music experience. It allows users to have access to uh, Arabic and international music. They can stream and download music and it's unlimited. So you just subscribe and you have all the music experience you want, online and offline. I see. And in this region, do you compete with iTunes for downloads or Spotify for streaming? Well, um, iTunes, not necessarily. First, there are no iTunes here in the region, neither Spotify. And uh, the, the two different, I mean, there are two different music, uh, music consumption models now. The iTunes model whereby you buy the songs, you download the songs, and you buy them and you own them. And the Spotify model whereby you have access to the songs and you subscribe for unlimited songs and you have them online and offline, but once you unsubscribe, you no longer have access to the songs. So we're more like the other model whereby you subscribe and you have unlimited access. This is why it's Anrami Unlimited Music or Music Unlimited. I see. And how did you make the platform or the idea local? Well, it started like uh, a year ago or even uh, even longer. Uh, we started first to explore uh, the market, to explore the uh, licenses around, to see what we can do. Uh, it's a really tough exercise to have all the labels on board and license the content, etc. Then we moved to the technology part and start to see uh, what's needed for us to build our platform because we, 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 we have our own technology, we have our own uh, platforms, we don't rely on any third party, so uh, it took us a, a, a while to figure out what's the best platform to build, especially that we are now also having a technology that is a Dolby Pulse technology, which is the latest in the streaming, that provides less encoding, that provides a very uh, clear and uh, and, and, and clear and uh, excellent quality of music and it's very uh, fast to, to download and stream. So this is the latest technology by Dolby and we're really proud to be the first streaming service in this region to offer this technology. And uh, this is it, I mean, this is the part where you have to secure the content and to work on the uh, platform and the technology. But in terms of making it local, how did yes. you focus on that? Actually, uh, we really believe that uh, everything you do, especially that we are really focused for the Middle East, that's why it's called Anrami, which means my tunes. Uh, we had to make stuff that are really localized. Uh, we cannot really, uh, we, we don't, we don't want to really now uh, divulge what we are planning in terms of localization, apart from the content being really localized, having the local content in every country that really the consumers want and to provide the user experience. We're banking on social definitely, we're trying to have probably a Facebook uh, integration also, so all this is on our roadmap and we hope that We'll, we'll, we'll have everything that the user here in the region would want from a music service. And how are you going to face piracy? Well, we always say that we're pirating the pirates. We believe that if you offer a good product, a good user experience, whatever that can be better than piracy, people would leave piracy and come to our service. So we're, we're, we're challenging the piracy now. I hope that will succeed. And uh, how do users in the region consume music? Mostly? For the time being, there are no, actually, there are no legitimate uh, music services. You cannot uh, buy music properly. There are few initiatives, very few uh, music stores. Uh, part of them are with the operators, but there are no big music uh, services. And uh, we think that we're solving this problem now. If you want really a good music experience, so you can have Anrami and subscribe to Anrami and have your own music experience on the web, on the mobile, on the tablet, everywhere you go, you'll have all, the, all your music with your playlists, with your, uh, with the whole, your whole music library, your whole music experience. For instance, if you want to have a playlist for your gym, playlist for while you're uh, skiing, playlist while you are in the car, etc., you have your own playlist and you have them online or offline. And everywhere you go, on your computer, on your tablet, on your uh, phone, you can have the same libraries and enjoy your music immediately. And you said you are going to integrate with social media to allow people to stream. Absolutely, yeah. yes. Uh, actually, uh, we know how social media and mainly Facebook 
can be really instrumental in, 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 in scaling and having a huge reach to the, to the larger audience. We, we, we're, we're planning to integrate with, with, uh, with Facebook. Uh, it's too soon to talk about this, but hopefully uh, from, we, we will manage to, to, to make this integration happen. And will the investment help? How are you using that investment thus far? Well, uh, the investment is, is instrumental in every venture. And uh, we are fortunate enough to have the, the, real, the needed fund to, 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 to finance such project. Because, as I told you, it's a big project. It's very, uh, it's, it's, it's really costly to have all these things, all these licenses, all these platforms built. So we're fortunate enough to have, so far, MEVP funding us and backing us. And we'd really like to thank them, really, for their trust and this opportunity to have such partners. Again, Mabrook. Thank you. Thanks for chatting with me. Thank Mama. you, Anna.